Well, what I'm trying to do here is make anchors. Make the base uh, make the bases for the thing. As you can see, uh, yeah, I'm just uh, welding the the nut to the to the base plate, and then uh, what I'll do is this will be hidden under that channel. The uh, the nuts and the bolts will come from the other end. I'm just using the bolts to hold the nuts down. Uh, the th the holes are threaded, so uh, yeah. I'm gonna uh, check a few things. Uh, let's see, one of those things is where the hell is my wrench? Uh, we'll find a wrench. Anyway, uh, this is what I'm doing today. Uh, anchors. Then I gotta take these to. Uh, Kukui, I run a center drill down through these uh, through these uh, holes, and uh, just to make sure that uh, the holes that were already drilled, well, actually for that, especially for that, for the center holes. And then the other uh, holes, I'll take an end mill, and I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna open those holes up in the uh, truck bed, so that uh, I have a little bit of leeway. When I when I install these uh, these racks, I'm gonna um, I'm I'm leaning toward uh, three eighths. You know, uh, three eighths hole, and uh, with the uh, and what I'm gonna do underneath instead of using washers, I'm cutting these and I'm drilling five sixteenths holes in these. And uh, there'll be little tabs with holes in them, and they'll act as washers. And uh, they'll be underneath in the channel. And uh, I'm gonna make them a, a little bit long. One of these is gonna have a center hole, and equal equal length. And two of them will be on the end uh, because of where it'll be at, because where the holes are at. Uh, and that's sh because of its uh, its width and all that. It should uh, it should keep the the bolts from from pulling through the the holes drilled in the rail. I'm um, just uh, taking an extra precaution to make sure that these racks can never come off on the load. No matter how big the load, she'll be held on to the uh, the bed of the truck. Another thing I'm thinking about doing, because these holes are so big, I'm going to cut uh, some of these bed frames, and I'm going to uh, I'm going to I'm going to overlay it so that uh, uh, part of it acts as a flashing uh, for the tunnel cover, and uh, then I'll have all these holes over here as uh, plug welds to make sure that thing is really uh, solid and tight to this and then I'll put um, I'll put all his D-rings uh, all the D-rings for Mikey uh, what the hell I did with that chain but it's around here someplace uh, and uh, I have uh, those those chain links to make uh, uh, to make D-rings so I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, boo. Oh, aloha everybody out there in YouTube land, Facebook land. Never, never land in the land, a rubber band. Yeah, this chief. Fuck, man, I just got home. After drilling holes <laughs> at Kukui. Fucking sun was so hot to kick my ass. Uh, it's still recovering from being sick, but uh whew. anyway. 
This is what I got done uh, when I got back from Kukui. Uh, I did this one side. I just did a bunch of uh, staggered out beads. Uh, I still got to put beads in between. If I'm going to make a uh, continuous, if I'm going to do a continuous to cover this thing up and seal it up really good, I'm going to have to uh, put in more beads in between. Otherwise, what will happen is she'll get hot and she'll start pulling and then, uh, you know, we'll, have, we'll, we'll start having some problems. But she came out pretty good. Uh, I ran a tap back through these holes, and I'm gonna do that with the other side after I get that, that thing welded in. I'm gonna run a tap back through the holes, and I will grind all these edges. Uh, well, I actually sand them with the, with the flap disc, and uh, you know, clean it all up. I still gotta plug these ends, but uh, what I think I'm gonna do is, when I stand it up again, I'm gonna do what I did here. You notice there's a, uh, I kind of shot a short little bead in that corner, just to tie in both sides and make it make it really solid. Then I'm gonna cap, I'm gonna cap this off. I'm gonna cap off this end, cap off the end in the front. Uh, Probably what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a disc and sand this thing till I'm flush with this. Then I'll take uh, some flat bar and, and cap it all off. And I uh, should be okay. <sighs> Man, I feel weak. But I got through the day. Anyway, wanted to show you guys this. Uh, and uh, those of you out there that have uh, donated, uh, I think uh, because I've been running into problems with uh, machines locally getting sold out from under me, when my friend Pete comes in uh, uh, from California uh, next week, I'm not sure if he comes, he lands in the islands Tuesday or he'll be here Tuesday. Uh, I want to take him uh, on a little trip to Waimea and uh, with whatever uh, I have I'm gonna I'm gonna make an offer on this I'm gonna make an offer on the Miller Big D4 and uh, your uh, your donations will be a great help I'm uh, one of the reasons why I thought about making a, an offer uh, is because of what Uncle Lloyd told me yesterday that he's uh, he's waiting on Jeffrey, Art's brother, who's going to be uh, uh, pulling out uh, the the different welding machines that. Art has and uncle is thinking about buying one from Art and if that's the case that means uncle's going to have a machine and I'm uh, I'm going to make an offer on this because I really 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 don't want to give up this Miller Big D4 on him you know and uh, with everything that's been happening with machines on on uh, Craigslist here in the Hawaiian Islands disappearing on me, uh, 
I just don't, more so, I don't want to give this machine up and I'm going to make Uncle an offer. Uh, like I said, I, I have, I also have uh, Brother Pete, he's, he's uh, donated some money. Well, he was uh, going to give me some money anyway just to help help get me off my feet. And uh, with uh, whatever I get in donations and uh, whatever I get from Pete, I'm going to make an offer on this machine. I'm not sure what it's going to be. I don't know what the price is going to be. But I'm going to put down what I can and uh, I'm gonna see what I can do about uh, getting this machine. So with that, uh, yeah, this is a uh, chief. You uh, are not only racks for Mikey, but a uh, little update, okay? And to till next time. Like I said, this chief, Aloha, wide.